Hello and welcome to Williams TV. Good. Actually, that was a terrible clap. Clap again. So this is this is the last time. Why are you shouting? The three of us. This is the last hurrah. He's running away. Why are you shouting? How would, are you feeling emotional about him running away? Oh, this is my booming voice. I'm not shouting. This is just my booming voice. You're projecting yourself. Yeah. Um, are you sad about him running away from us? Yeah. We will miss him. I think. Uh, He's not crying yet. He's not yet, but he will. Sunday. Next year, next year he will cry. When he's in Melbourne and oh, we're, we're all in Melbourne and he's not, he'll be crying his eyes out then. Are you sure he will not be in Melbourne? Oh, I don't know. That's a good question, really. <laughs> uh, hello, Rob. How are you? Hi, I'm all right. You, you've broken the microphone. Hang on, let me just stick that back on. Um, so we've had FB1 here. Uh, yep. How was it? Before I ask him, how was it for the team? Uh, it's a bit of a waste of time, to be honest. The track temperature is 50 degrees uh, compared to it will be minimum 10, 15 degrees cooler than that. Um, so in, is this the least relevant session of the, you know, for the season? Because you go to Singapore where it's, again, we have a similar situation day into night, things like that. But is this, is this the most at least, yeah, but don't, don't forget in Singapore most least relevant? In, in, in Singapore, you kind of go from twilight to, to dark. Yeah. Whereas here you go from uh, from blazing sun. sunshine middle of the day to, to, to twilight in the dark. So it's um, this this is this is yeah a bit of a waste of time. Uh, I guess it wasn't a waste of time for you. At least you got out there and did some laps. Did you enjoy it? Well, yeah. I, it has been uh, nearly four months. I have been not in the car, so uh, yeah, I took it quite easy. First round, I, I thought it was not bad, reasonable. Uh, Second round, we did test a few things, so uh, it was more oriented uh, for uh, next year uh, and to learn something. So, uh, yeah, I will not take uh, any, let's say, performance out of it, but uh, it was good to do it. Uh, knowledge uh, is important and uh, to know where we should go, to know what we, where we have to focus. So, yeah, uh, we will continue work uh, next week. Uh, so I was going to say, you, you know, you're doing the tests next week, obviously. Um, for a change, our Facebook feed is going to be full of Polish fans, you know, cheering rather than asking the question about where you're going to be. So, um, you know, what, what is the plan now for the next few days? Talk, talk us through because, you know, the test is on Tuesday, isn't it? You're going to be first in. Yeah, I mean, uh, I will attend the weekend like always. Uh, a bit more media stuff to do. <laughs> Yeah, you're in high demand. Yeah, it will, it will disappear sh uh, soon. So <laughs> it's, it's just a short period. Uh, and then, uh, well, uh, Monday we will have a bit of break and uh, Tuesday, Wednesday testing, which is important. First time with uh, 2019 tires. Uh, a lot of things to learn, a lot of things to discover. And I think it's a very crucial test. Uh, so let's hope uh, we can do a proper uh, running with uh, proper uh, uh, tires and uh, learn a lot. Um, what's your plan? Are you, are you sticking around for the test or are you no, off? Okay. No, no, I'll follow it from the, from the factory. But like Robert said, I mean, we've kind of defined what the test program is. Um, it's absolutely crucial, I think, for the team to get through all of that work. I and mean, we've got more work than we've got time to do. But this will be um, the best chance we've got of, of completing the 2019 tyre testing after that. Um, there isn't really another chance until you get to into the, the Grand Prix season. So it's a really crucial test for the team. Um, you know, it's 50% of the performance on the car between the tires and the aerodynamics. So um, we've got a lot of work to do. And, and for people at home, just to, to understand, you know, this is, uh, what's it like as a circuit to go testing at? Because when you test, you test through the day, don't you? And then do you also test into the dark? Or how, how does all that work? No, we don't test on the dark. Oh, we... I'm asking you, I don't know. No, no, uh, well, it, it will. Well, until what time we test? Until five? Six. 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 So we will get like, uh, uh, not full dark, but uh, a better uh, condition in the last hour. But uh, honestly, I think uh, from, from what we have to learn, uh, what we have to do, it, it, yeah, it's definitely highlighting more issues when it's hot. But actually, it's good. You have to, you have to test the tires in hot condition, on demanding conditions. Uh, because, as Rob say, in Barcelona, on winter testing, we might uh, struggle with, uh, with cold conditions. So 
and it will be first and last time in such a condition to test uh, new tires. So uh, although the tire, the cars are different, they are dynamically they are, will be different, but still, uh, uh, the, you know, uh, the, the tires are the heart of current Formula One. So uh, you have to really pick up as small as many information as you can. Um, are you now? happy that we're, we're into the on-track running, because so, you spent most of yesterday talking to journalists in here. Are you happy now that there's cars going around and there's less talking for you to do? Yeah, I mean, for sure. Uh, but uh, yes, it was uh, a normal circumstance or consequence of uh, what happened, so I'm happy uh, that I went through it. It, it hasn't been so painful. Uh, so uh, <laughs> so uh, we are ready and yeah, looking forward uh, for testing definitely. Um, and Rob, for the rest of the weekend now, I mean, FP2 later today is, is a massively important session, isn't it, to prepare the car for qualifying in the race? Yep. Uh, well, this is where we have to do all of our learning, really, for, for qualifying the race. As you said, the track temp will be about um, anywhere from, from 40 dropping down to 30 degrees, so much more representative. Um, so we've got some experiments that we want to do going into P2, but, but mainly it's just about using the tyres, low fuel, high fuel. And then, and then we'll see. Very good. Okay. Um, I think we'll leave it on that. Rob, it's been fun that. having you on Williams TV, your last ever cameo. This what? The uh, last one. And uh, uh, that's the last, last one. one together. Yes. Yeah. And I, I feel it, it was too serious. It was too serious. Okay, oh, tell oh, us a yeah. joke. Come on, let's have a joke. Oh. Let's have some man. Ti amo. <laughs> Are you going to tell us a joke now? Uh, he has to. Okay, he has to say a joke. No, to he say has goodbye. To say what he remembers from the fans and what was the. Yeah, say goodbye to our fans. No, I don't have to tell you my best Abu Dhabi moment. Oh yes, sorry, 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 sorry. Tell us your best Abu Dhabi. Did Actually, I want to know. In 2010, when you were at Ferrari, ah, when no, no, Fernando no. lost the championship, no, 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 no. I know you were on the other side of the garage. <laughs> I was here. I saw Fernando. <laughs> Uh, it was all a bit stressed. <laughs> um, how was it? Uh, Come on, you've got to have a story about that. It's got to be an insight. I know it's not a happy story, but it's a good story. It was, uh, you it were was, there. It was tense. It was a tense atmosphere for about three months afterwards. <laughs> um, I went on holiday to Australia quite soon afterwards to um, escape the tension. <laughs> so it was tense. But I wouldn't put that in my top Abu Dhabi moment. No, no, but <laughs> I want to know, did you, have a, like, did you have a debrief and everything? Like, did you try I, and do yeah, a yeah, normal yeah. plan I afterwards? I was working on the other car. I said oh. that already, all right? I remember that, all right? I've said it. <laughs> Carry on. Um, yeah, we had a debrief, and it was tense. <laughs> it was tense. <laughs> okay. There was some swear words. Yeah, I'll bet. Okay, tell us your top Abu Dhabi moment. Not that one, clearly. Um, on track, on track, I would probably say it was with Williams. I'm, I'm on Williams TV, so I have to be kind to Williams. Uh, it's contracted. But I would say it was with Williams in 2014, in um, when we we were a few laps away, probably from winning the race. So we we waited. Um, bye. See you later. Bye. So we waited bye. until. The, Where's he going? We we did the final stop really late, and we put the the quali tire on, and then we were hunting down Lewis. So things have changed over the last five years. I'm not sure we'll be hunting down Lewis this Sunday. Okay, on that bombshell. <laughs> uh, we will uh, see you on Sunday. See you Sunday.